Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to Dumber Mods, and I've got an Ender Sword to show you. Yes, you're gonna need an Ender Pearl. It's cool, and this is a fresh look at the mod before it's being updated. Uh, there are a couple improvements that I would like to suggest to the mod maker, and I'm sure that you will agree uh, to make this mod actually really cool and useful for the general uh, Minecraft audience. So let's take a look at the the Ender Sword and what it exactly what it does. First, I'll show you how to actually make one. Do 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 do. Where's my arms? Every single time, losing my arms. So. First problem, it requires a lot of diamonds. Ten diamonds, uh, you need uh, an ender pearl, a block of diamond, and one extra diamond. Actually, I might as well grab that, because I'm going to show you how it, it it is created. So block of diamond in the middle, diamond at the bottom, ender pearl at top gives you the ender sword. It is as strong as a diamond sword with one characteristic in it, and that is when you're fighting. Ha, whoa, whoa. Oh, I better go into non-creative mode you're getting those mobs and suddenly you're getting overwhelmed because you know let's face it even with a diamond sword you can still get in situations where you're overwhelmed and you're gonna die and sometimes you know not switching to your to the ender pearl then an ender pearl is, is is fine but you know you're you're switching like this and oh throw the sword boom you're out of there so that's what it does it basically acts as an ender pearl and I'll throw one back see if I can get back to the bench oh close so basically it uses the suggestions that I'm going to make for this is that it uses too much diamond. I get it that it, you know, it's a specialized tool so it should technically use more diamond than just two and an ender pearl. I mean you want it to make it hard uh, to actually create because it's a specialized weapon. So you know maybe, I don't know, Chop that in half or something, because 10 seems a little excessive. I know that the mod maker actually, uh, and I was reading his comments, he made it specifically for one person. So there was a specific purpose why this individual made this mod. It wasn't just like, hey, I'm going to make an ender sword. It was for someone who asked for this mod, so that's what he made. But I'm sure he's going to tailor it down, maybe not make it so resource intensive, which will be nice. The other thing that I'm going to suggest, and I think others have suggested this as well, is that there's more than one use out of it. Uh, and by that I mean not just one throw and it's done. Maybe make it so that there's three teleports. Because let's face it, a diamond sword is durable. Why should you lose it just from throwing it once? Maybe like it sticks into something, whatever. Wherever the sword lands, you, you end up picking it back up and it's got like three three teleports in it you know what I mean that makes it valuable then you would be like okay well now I see a purpose why would I throw my diamond sword when I could just use an ender pearl but if you use one ender pearl and you got because of the durability of the diamond sword you got like three throws out of it that would make it worth the while so you know bring down the the use or the requirement of the diamonds and give it like maybe two or three throws you know, making it useful, making one ender pearl into something a little more valuable rather than just having a diamond sword and an ender pearl. And then this mod would be super cool. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you liked it. Stay tuned for more dumber mods in the future.